Hello watching News First Prime, I am Rahul Dayan. Today I am at a place where it serves traditional, authentic Malnad recipe and of course that recipe is so beneficial to your health and of course your well-being also. And that recipe is none other than Namma Tambuli. So to serve that great dish, I have a place here in Bengaluru's Banchankri 6 stage that is Tambuli Mane and the tagline is Grandma's Recipe. So it is basically a traditional authentic recipe from Nama Karnataka's Malna district. So let's take you inside and explore the kitchen of Namma Tambuli Mane. I told you that great recipe is inside this earthen pot and of course it serves a lot of benefits for your health and the main highlight of this recipe is that it's a traditionally handmade recipe and that recipe is originated from the authentic Malnad Shumoga. So we have a lot of tambulis here and I'm very curious to know which tambuli actually serves what purpose. So to know more about that, I have with me Karthik from Tambuli Mane. Karthik, hi. Hi, hi. So we have got a lot of Tambulis yes. here. And I've heard that there are 50 Tambuli recipes from yes. Tambuli Mane. So we actually do 50 plus varieties of Tambuli here. Mm -hmm. But every day it cycles depending on the seasons, where how we grow, how plants grows in the region, right? Like so based on the season. Exactly. And also everything is sourced from Malnad, Malnad to regularly here. So everything you have, you see is very fresh okay. and very uh, clean, clean. We have a concept of clean food. Okay. So everything you eat is clean. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. even a tadka, which is used here mm -hmm. is also used for, uh, made from coconut oil. Okay. So no not like a re oil, regular no, exactly. refined oil, okay. no refined oil, no palm oil, anything. Okay. So even a green chili, we don't use green chili. We use something called suji minso. Which is Pepper. very no no. Which is a sm small chilies which grown uh, in Malnad region. Okay. So which doesn't give you acidity to when you consume it. Right. So right. these are some of the eight varieties which we have today. Okay. So, I think I I'm very curious to know about guava leaves tambuli. Yes. So this you have this you have brahmi tambuli. Yes. You have lemongrass tambuli yes. and mango ginger. Could you please explain uh, the so, highlights of so this? So if you see uh, brahmi tambuli, right, that really helps you uh, boosting your memory power. Memory power. Yes. And uh, if you see a lot of heart related issues, uh, really helpful if you have a bilvapatram tambuli. Okay. And lemongrass tambuli, if you see, it really helps you not getting dehydrated daily. Oh. So it balances your water in your body. Water content. Yes, exactly. Okay. So that is that is a magic of these. So every herbs or every roots which goes inside this mm -hmm. is uh, really helpful. And also these are the things which used to be understood by our ancestors or people. Uh -huh. And whenever they grow, these are not they they didn't used to go go to like market and get these. So they used to grow outside their place. Uh -huh. These would have been grown. Uh -huh. They used to just pick depending on the season and then they used to cook and they used to eat it. Right, right, right. So here, which you see all these kind of tambulis, every single tambuli has a specific, uh, you know, health benefit. For example, guava beet or brahmi or lemongrass, mango ginger, all of these have a specific benefits, health benefits. And more than that, it is traditionally made here in tambuli mane. Karthik, this looks a very delicious and a colorful spread. Yeah. And typically, it's a Malnad style uh, dish. So, please uh, let us know what exactly is on my 
banana leaf today yes so what you are seeing is a unlimited uh, banana leaf meal what we have uh, introduced in banshankri uh, tambuli mane mm-hmm. but uh, the tambuli which you are seeing right now this is a eatable format mm-hmm. this is more thicker in consistent mm-hmm. the tambuli which you drank down that is a drinkable format like a buttermilk format yes exactly. consistency okay. so this is also based on buttermilk okay but this is more of a thick in consistency mm-hmm. and so anything you see in this leaf right we have this concept called clean food uh-huh. so wherein we want everyone who eats should have a healthy meal mm-hmm. wherein so if you see anything which is cooked in this is no refined oil no palm oil it is a very clean food so we don't use more of a whites in this no white salt uh, no white salt and also we can start digging in and yeah. we can start. and very special is this salt here ha huh. so this salt is called sani kata this is a more of a sea salt sea salt so this is not the refined white salt which you get on the shops right yeah. so that is a speciality of it and if you see this is not normal pulio gray or normal flavored rice mm-hmm. the, the we don't get any kind of powders mm-hmm. we don't get any kind of powders and on we, we cook the chutney here and we mix we add a coconut oil onto a hot rice and we mix it the way how we do it in house right uh, so this is a <coughs> uh, payasam so we also use a uh, bottle uh, bottle guard exactly so and the speciality of this is we don't use sugar refined sugar or not even a normal jaggery we use mm-hmm. this is made with a uh, pure form of jaggery mm-hmm. where you get it it will be still in water consistency when we get it the tambuli and the rice also when you mix it the consistency yeah. is so good yeah. it blends well with the exactly. tambuli exactly and even the rice which you are seeing right so this is also sourced from malnad mm-hmm. so this is a rice called mede muglu mm-hmm. wherein uh, this is unpolished and uh, steamed rice okay and if you see any kind of polished rice right so if you mix it with sambar or rasam you can still see that it just parts away So if you want to experience a traditional Malnad style food with the same style of serving I think Tambuli Mane in Banshankri is the place which you need to look out for so if you want to experience or relish that typical traditional authentic tambuli in house in Namo Bengaluru especially the people from Malnad region do come to this place and visit the store here and of course you would definitely thank me later on For more such updates and daily life content subscribe to news first prime and of course share this video